the best piece of advice. Wow, that is such an end of life question. <laughs> That really is that. They, nobody ever comes to like a 22 year old and like, best advice. And they're like, well, beer on liquor, never been sicker. All right. Uh, the best advice, I'm trying to think of uh, good advice. I don't really, I don't seek counsel in that way. Do you, like a mentor, I didn't have a mentor. This was back in like late 70s, early 80s, so there were no mentors. I was raised feral. So I don't have uh, a ton of. Uh, a ton of advice. Oh, here's one. This is a good one. So I used to host a show on MTV. It was a talk show. And then it got bought by Paramount to replace Arsenio. So I was the natural replacement for Arsenio. Because <laughs> I think a lot of people are like, hey, uh, the hip African-American guy, let's stick a maybe small Jew in his place <laughs> and see what happens. Uh, and so... Uh, the show was on for like nine months and it got canceled and uh, we were all very sad and when your name is on it and they tell you to get out of the building like it's, it's very hurtful David Letterman came on the final show and on the final show he said to me don't confuse cancellation with failure and I thought that was really interesting and then in the commercial break he said although this is also a failure <laughs> He just, he just didn't want me to confuse it. <laughs>